Got a 1972 Plymouth Duster, original AM FM radio. Uh, we've done a conversion on it with the Roar Design parts. It now has AM FM stereo, four channels out, 45 watts a channel built in it. It has auxiliary in. Uh, this cable comes with it here that you can hide and you also get the mail to mail that will work on it. Uh, to plug your devices in. It has Bluetooth and voice command. <coughs> right now you're on FM. Now you're on AM radio. Back to FM and what we've done we've got an operating LED here it tells you where the radio is at when you switch it. Uh, the FM light, when you turn it to the FM, we put the stereo light in behind there. That way when you hit a stereo channel, it will light up for you. Right now we're going to run the Bluetooth in. Bring our phone up. And we're on Bluetooth. We're going to take the volume knob and turn it down twice. Alright, that beep tells you that it's on. A roar design come up, push on it, and we're gonna let it pair up. That beep there tells you that you are paired up. Voice command works, same volume knob, up twice. Play music. If you want to change your songs, we're going to play music on my phone. Just take your tuner knob. The thing with Sears wasn't as painful as buying the car in the first place because I had to talk to a car salesman to get it. And this will, this will actually work your phone where you can uh, rotate your songs. You can back up and repeat. You can bring her back up and ask her to call home or find a restaurant. And she will find that for you. It depends on where you're at. Stop music. All right, she's put it in pause. And now it's going to cycle back around the radio. That's how your Bluetooth and voice command work. Takes just a second. Just cycle back around. Back on FM stereo. You still have your treble and bass. We have uh, We had to replace the whole shaft in there and all because the plastic ear was broke off of it. The knob wouldn't stay on it. Now we're going to show you how the fader and balance works. If you uh, use all four channels, three channels or four, you can pick up fader and balance. Two uh, channels out give you balance. Uh, the radio automatically knows every time you turn it on how many speakers you're running. Uh, your balance and fader is built in your toner. This is treble and bass. Now we're going to go to fader first. We're going to go clockwise twice on this knob here. I'm going to quit beeping. Now you can front to rear. You can set up your fader on. When you find what you want, let go. Now we're back on treble and bass. Now the opposite direction, counterclockwise, will give you balance. Right and left. Now you're back on treble and bass. Anonymous black market that existed on this hidden internet. That one was taken down in October. Let's go back to fighter.
this piece of investigation by the FBI. Didn't that quite get it right. No now I'm hearing all four channels. The minute that went down, a number of other replica sites turned up in its place. And there are... Your auxiliary ends, if you want this one I like because you can switch it from AM to FM. Anything can be bought and sold. Your auxiliary so end. It really is like a hydra's head. The Silk Road has gone, but there are plenty more that have taken its place. Now, you bought something. You also you get the mail to mail cable it. with was it. Was it the Silk Road or one of the which other Which is side? this one here. Well, it was the Silk and Road. And you plug it in to wherever you want to hide that. Um, within a month. Plug it into your device. Silk Road. Uh, being taken offline, so it was more or less. Turn it on to the Silk Road with the same sort. Press of one product. button, and now you're in. That's how your auxiliary works. Uh, you can come out of that at any time. And you can go right back to it. Turn it off. And we'll go back to stereo. You get this little mic that you can hide. It's got plenty of cord. You have five free outs. All your connections are on this side here for your auxiliary and your mic. Uh, new wiring harness. It will have your original plug on it to plug into your original harness for your power and your light. That way your dash light and everything works like it did. The rest of it will be a ground and speaker wires. It will be labeled for you. <coughs> Hope you like it. <laughs>